Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Welcome if you're returning and welcome if you're new. We've had quite an increase in subscribers recently. So thank you so much for viewing, liking, sharing and subscribing. It really means a lot. If any of you would like a private reading, by the way, they're currently available and the link to my shop is in the description box. Now, onto this reading. Um, I've really been guided recently to do this reading by the Divine. This is generally how it works with me. I've been getting a lot of signs, different signs linked to this place in particular that I'm going to focus on in this reading. Now, for legal reasons, I'm not going to name it. Um, so I'll just sort of give you some clues so you can decipher where I'm talking about. First of all, um, I kept getting ads recently on my YouTube feed for this place, really randomly because I've never been there, would never want to go there either, but up it came. I also had a dream about it about a week ago and I believe that's why I kept seeing the ads, to piece it together, um, that that was what my dream was about it wasn't clear in my dream. Anyway, I'll mention my dream a bit later to you all. Um, this place is a resort theme park. It's very famous. I believe they have two in the US and then others around the world. Uh, the one I'm going to focus on in this reading is in Orlando, Florida. They have famous characters, films, studios, very popular with young children and families. So I'm sure you can work out where I'm talking about. Um, this is obviously my opinion only, alleged. I'm looking at the energy of this place in terms of what's come through to me recently. Now, in terms of it coming through to me as well, I believe that's a sign that maybe something's happening behind the scenes there that we may find out about soon in terms of what really goes on there. And that's what I'm being guided to share in this reading with you all. Now this morning, the vision that came through to me was a coin for this place. Now obviously, first of all, we're getting money with that, aren't we? You know, um, a lot of money that they get at this resort. But there's another business behind the scenes that goes on there. Also, this coin is very shiny on the outside. Bright, sparkling, enticing. You know, people want to spend their money there. Flip that coin around. It's dark, dirty, disgusting, dingy. So that's the energy I get immediately for this place. Now let me share my dream as well. In this dream I was in a very small room. There was a man with me, I, I don't know who he was. And there was some long red tiles on the wall. And it was like they had red sequins on them. It was very sparkly anyway. And I remember I pulled off a tile and then the man did as well. And we unveiled this big room. Um, so it was a fake wall hiding this room. Then I remember we went down tunnels as well. And there were loads of dead rats everywhere. Yeah, not very nice, I know. Um, now, for me, the symbol I was getting there was victory over dark energies with rats, dirty. You know, they were all dead. So that's what I mean. I feel something has happened in this place behind the scenes. It was also very interesting that there was a young girl in the dream who had a dustpan and brush and she was helping clear away these rats. So that's very interesting. Um, and as I said, I feel I've got the link there with that dream and this place. So there are hidden rooms there. There are tunnels where dark stuff 
happens, I believe. Was my dream showing me, you know, there's this secret clear up happening there at the moment or to come, you know, it could have been a premonition. But there was something about that place in particular um, that came through to me strongly. So watch this space. Um, just going to see now, obviously I don't need cards, but I just want to see with the images, obviously I read intuitively in these readings, see if we can get any clues. Wow. Everyone, I just got a really heavy energy there as I picked up this card. It says entrapment. And notice the skull. And obviously the symbolism of the dead rats, you know, um, I don't think it's just been dark energies that have died there. I believe some quite innocent people have been trapped down there in those tunnels. Yeah, I'm getting emotions now. Secret chambers where they're kept, like slaves, is now coming through. And so there are skulls down there um, in those tunnels and chambers. It's coming through there. It's interesting there are curtains, you know, behind curtains and behind doors. Like in my dream, the tiles. Wow, that one needs to come out. Yeah, now this may give some of you a clue come through here with the fairy in terms of the characters you know so these fairy tale dreams that are sold to the public um, it all looks like this fairy tale doesn't it all these lovely fairy tale stories but behind closed doors, it's very interesting here. Look at the imagery, they're both lying on their side. So some have these beautiful dreams about this place, but they don't realize this is actually what ha happens. Um, sorry for on my camera, just cut out there. It's interesting we've got a bed as well. I'm sure you can deduce a little bit more um, about what goes on in these secret chambers. I'm not going to reveal too much because it's quite graphic. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm getting very heavy energies coming through with that card there. You know, something else has come through here because it is interesting the way they're both lying on the same side. It's like Someone may fall asleep and have dreams, you know, and then they wake up and they're trapped somewhere. They've been abducted. This is also coming through. Um, something else that came through in my vision, though, is transport, transportation to this place. that happens regularly. So, you know, the, some of these energies are innocent. They don't know where they're being taken. That's what's coming through. I'm getting the airport, train station, in particular as locations where certain, you know, journeys happen. It's all planned. 
behind the scenes. People don't know about this. Okay, just dropped it. Too many cards there. Anything else? Any other clues? Yeah. This is what I'm feeling, you know, at the moment. Sadness. And this is like that trapped energy there. So, you know, again, it looks like this. If we look at it this way, in the middle, we've got these dreams, this fairy tale fantasy place. Everyone wants to go there, but behind the scenes, we've got people who've been trapped, taken against their will. There's a very sad energy behind the scenes. So there's that coin again, you know, shiny on the outside dark on the other side. Okay, I'm just going to switch my cards and see if we can get anything else about what goes on behind the scenes this place. We've already got the story here coming through. Okay, everyone, now we're looking at behind the scenes here, and again, this is quite difficult, but um, we've got a child coming through here, this card represents potentially a child. Now this energy looks trapped here, and the sword is pointing down, showing negative things that happen to this young person or young people. This card is about cycles and it can show birth, death, renewal. So this is what happens behind the scenes, as I said. I've already felt this, but we're getting confirmation here. Um, this card can show brute force, dark stuff that happens, which we're seeing here, what I'm seeing with this card is this apple is rotten to the core. So there's some really dark, disgusting energies, as I said at the beginning. Now, this card did fly out reversed. You may have seen that before. So with that, the message I'm getting is a lack of growth. Um ill health coming through a very a very dark energy anyway it's coming out behind the scenes in this resort have any of you ever been um i'm just wondering you know if you're good at picking up on energy if you've ever picked up anything um there in particular but the energy i get as I said about the coin at the beginning, is that they just want profits. Um, so what happens on the outside, that fairy tale, is just their way of pumping money into this other stuff that happens behind the scenes. It's all just a cash cow, that's what keeps coming through to me. Let's just do another layer. Yeah, it's interesting how I'm doing this one as layers there are so many layers to that place that people wouldn't even know about. Oh, 
Well, I'm just being guided right away to the key. And the door, you see? Secrets. What's behind some of those doors? That people, you know, forbidden. People don't go into those rooms, but some do. Now, I'm also being guided to 33 here. A secret society behind this that started all of this, someone quite high up who planned out that place to the T. When they made all their plans, they knew exactly what they were going to do, what they were going to create. Yeah, see, I'm getting wow well with this one because I'm reading intuitively, the different paths, that's linking to what I just said. So a map, you know, there are loads of little tunnels. There might even be signs down there so people know which way to go. Can't make this up. With the anchor, I'm just getting a very heavy place down there. It's pointing down, so below, a lot of this takes place below this resort. Okay everyone, I'm just getting tears to my eyes here. Um, this is so sad. But with this one, I'm getting deals, payoffs that happen behind the scenes, contracts. The rose is significant, I feel, as a symbol. Red. It's interesting, in my dream, I saw red. Mm, which society might we link red to? We've got red there as well. See, even with this card, it can show obstacles, but again, as you know, I read intuitively. We've got like all these different trails and again underground is coming out with that one yeah we've got a fox as well cunning energies clever but deceptive and a cross for that heavy energy again i'm also hearing sacrifice with this card that happens behind the scenes. I'm being, it's like I'm being guided to put this that way, which shows us, you know, not spiritual energies. They might even have this sign down in those tunnels. So they're anti this, basically, you know. Wow, everyone. You might be able to feel it, but like the deeper we go, the heavier this gets. Um, it's just, you know, disgusting. Um, I'm getting a lot of symbols coming through as well in those tunnels, which I believe they use. So I'm getting sacrifice, SRA, Rituals. I can't mention it all, you know. Um, I'm seeing very young people. Yeah, I'm being guided to this one. See how, you know, she's dressed up, she's got wings. This is what they do. They make them dress up. So for them, you know, it's like a dream, isn't it? It was for me when I was a child dressing up, you know, you all love doing that, don't you? But then they make them do things that make them feel very sad. Their soul feels very sad. It breaks them. Their personality splits as a result of this CSA is what's coming through. This is what happens to people who experience trauma. And that's what the dark energies want. 
because then you lose yourself that creativity it's interesting this card as well yeah there's a paintbrush um, and palette there so she's looking away from that she's lost her creativity as a result of what happens here okay some of you may be triggered so you know take your time ground yourselves um, I have had to just pause the camera there just to ground myself anything else we can know about this place yeah you can't make this up everyone as soon as I saw that it made sense the chariot can indicate transport remember before I said about the airport trains cars as well yeah because we've got three horses three types of transport here's the emperor behind the scenes that makes all of this happen that coordinates this transport wow we've got an empress as well so it could be a couple there behind the scenes that makes all of this happen notice the rings in this card showing the networks they have lots of connections to not only transport providers um, but societies see we've got the roses again very interesting we're getting the rose I'm getting a society with that one dark society see the different corners you know people in different places they've got lots of connections we can work out what the what type of ring that is as well rings wow everyone this is so sad okay what I'd like to ask now is whether well, something's happening at the moment behind the scenes in terms of this being found out because this is what I'm feeling in terms of why I'm doing this reading I feel something's happening yeah we get a yes right away with the ace and the queen of cups wow notice the snake so a deceptive energy but here's an energy with their third eye open who can see past this deceptive energy they want to unveil the truth yeah wow you can't make this up if you won the two cups see how it's a mirror image I think it's the same her hair goes that way and that way yeah it's like a mirror image so what we see on the outside what goes on underground yeah so the truth we're getting it here watch this space the truth I believe is being exposed and will be exposed in terms of what happens in this place very negative stuff okay there's something I'm being guided to say here um, that I was planning to share see how we've got clouds here so it's like the sky and we have the chariot transport so airlines coming through here in particular so as we're looking at Orlando Florida I'm getting Orlando Airport um, I believe there are two but the main one the international one is coming through here some information about that airport I believe as well there's something very interesting to share with you that is fact you can look it up yourself the CEO of Orlando Airport just recently resigned hmm interesting that isn't it wonder why that might have been 
Sounds like that energy may be wanting to hide something or run away, maybe. Okay, so look it up, you know, you'll see. Um, that's another thing that I came across and I just pieced all of this together. So I'm going to end this reading now, because, um, but I'm, I am feeling a shift now from what's just come out there. Positive shift. So let's finish with one final message. Maybe some clues from this card. Okay, that one. We've got home. It's come out now. It's very interesting again, isn't it? How this lady's dressed up in a costume. Now I'm also seeing this energy is reading some documents here. So some information is what I'm getting with this one that's been discovered. Now is it maybe someone who works there that's come forward, you know, who wears these costumes? This also looks like a chamber. It's really interesting the imagery we're getting. Okay, so yeah, that's what I'm getting. That some evidence has been found. With home, this is very sad, but what I'm getting now. Um, for some, this chamber was like their home, that's all they saw. They never saw daylight. Well, this is like, this is a really hard one to, to do everyone, so please bear with me. Because of the amount of energies that I'm picking up on. I mean, we're talking thousands. Um, I'm not sure if you can see what it says there, sexual arts. We've got 33 again that we had here with key. Wow, I'm getting so many like shivers, you know, in this reading. Um, but it's it's so dark seeing this like fire, see, rituals that take place behind closed doors, as I said. And I'm seeing like this energy going up to the sky, you know, so again, sacrifice coming through here. I'm also, yeah, I'm getting the, like, we've got adults down there as well sure you can work out what I'm saying here. And younger energies. It's interesting how we keep getting the clouds. But the sword of truth is our sign here. The truth will come out about this sick stuff that these people have been doing. Okay, everyone, I'm going to leave that there. As I said, that was pretty heavy. Um, let us know in the comments if you wish, anything that you feel as well. But obviously, this is what I'm getting from the energy. Um, I do feel we're going to hear something about this sometime. Can't really say when, but maybe in the next few months. Who knows? So watch this space. Watch out for the fake 
psychics out there as well who may suddenly come out with this story as well. Because you won't find this anywhere else at the moment, I don't believe, out there. Because I'm genuine, this has like come to me um, from the divine to share. But anyway, trust your intuition as always in terms of what you watch, what you believe. Um, really hope you've enjoyed this reading though. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon.